So what's your favorite song on the new Cuddy album? Um, oh, why would you do that to me? That's like one of the most offensive questions of all time that could be asked. Huh? Yeah, I think it changes people every like day. Top, people are like, top 20 f- favorite Cuddy songs. I'm like, how the fuck could you ever do that? Yeah. Top 20? I don't even think I'd pick 100. No, that, I, that's, I that's literally how much of a stand I am. Exactly. That's crazy. I could not pick 100. Like the If I picked my top 100 Cuddy songs, like they, they would always just change. And I couldn't order it. <laughs> no, no <laughs> fucking shot. No. Um, okay, and the new album, though, I, obviously I love Tequila Shots. Um, Which you're allowed to listen to now because you're 21. Yeah. Um, those are alcohol-free because it's just a song. Uh, I love... Um, I mean, I love the whole album. Let me say that. But yeah. the ones that are standing out to me and that are in my head all day. It's going to change. Dive. Um, Elsie's Baby Boys is probably like my favorite just because it's so personal. Yeah. And like... It's so relatable for us. It, it, yeah, it's it's crazy. Like the the shit that Cuddy speaks about that he's and the things that he's gone through are like... I could relate to on like a really crazy level. Yeah, it's a, a really level great. that I never imagined being able to relate to. Him and it's all. so strange how like we got into Cuddy when we were twelve and didn't foresee any of the, the things that happened to him that had already happened to him happening to us in our future. Yeah, and it's almost like we're living this like strange synonymous life, minus a few things, but like a lot of shit is fucking like yeah, very yeah. Just, like chillingly comparable. Like I, li- I listen to like Cuddy is obviously a huge public figure. He's guy like he's a big music artist and stuff like that but like i i didn't even have social media before i had before i listened to i was listening to cuddy before i even had social media yeah. and then i became quote unquote public figure on social media you know what i mean so it's yeah. like i i can i can even relate to him in a certain way like you weren't with having with having more than just like my town's eyes on me yeah you know what i mean it's weird and then also like our dad's passing away yeah and then like a lot of mental health battles and, and stuff like that it's crazy it is his most recent interview has uh helped me on like a, a level that i can't even explain yeah I, re- I feel really happy for him the place he's in right now seems yeah. like really fucking great yeah he deserves it yeah but uh like the way he was saying how he uh he felt like if he continued to talk about his struggles and stuff like that in his songs, people would think like, oh, like, why haven't you figured your shit out yet? Like, I don't want to, like, where he, he would think before putting it out that people didn't want to listen to it because he hadn't figured his shit out yet. Yeah. And like, I've been there so many times where I was like about to put out a video and I don't have my shit figured out yet. Why, yeah. why are people going to watch it? They're just going to be tired of me, this guy that can never get his shit together. 